Hey, what's up guys? Victor Brown here from Napster Films. And guys, today I'm going to show you how to do the ghost effect in DaVinci Resolve 16. As you see, DaVinci Resolve 16 is loading. Uh, so I'm using the studio version, but you can do this using any other version, the free version. You can also do this in the free version. So I'm going to show you how to do this. So right away, guys, I'm going to load my clips. So you have to shoot this in one clip. So you see, this is me lying here. So this is my in point. So I'm going to select here this place that I'm relaxed as my end point and then I'm going to drag all this clip in here so once I have my clip in here I'm going to turn on the inspector let me just enlarge this for a minute and since I'm not going to use the media pool, let me just close this and activate two viewers. But I don't, I don't need two viewers as such. So let me just enlarge this, the video height and the audio height. So you have to find the place where I'm waking up. So this is the place that I'm still sleeping. So I'm going to select my clip. I'm going to hold on Control and B to cut. And then I'm going to move this top clip on another video track. So I'm going to place this and I'm going to right click and I'm going to select change clip speed. And then I'm going to freeze frame. Then I'm going to stretch this to the end of the clip. So right away I'm going to pull this a little bit further. So like until so, so I'm going to play my clip to the place that I'm waking up. In the place that I'm looking, looking at the hen or the dead man or something. 